Welcome back. Bunga, so there are two programs currently running with under Chewek Kuat's yeah. uh, that's, that's mentorship, of course, that's uh, 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 your main uh, yeah. program, correct? Uh, what are the other two programs that you're running at the moment? Okay, um, instead of we having a um, Chewek Kuat mentorship program, we have um, the new program. Um, it's actually now uh, still um, running, mm -hmm. uh, named Chewek Kuat for Change. Mm -hmm. Um, what is the Cherry Code for Change? It's actually to gather all the women who really have a concern with the social issue um, to be wants to be a volunteers for the non-profit or in institutional in their cities because Cherry Code uh, coverage in only ja uh, Jabodetabek only at the moment yeah. yeah at the moment so sometimes uh, all these women who have a um, you know very noble heart and she wants to be a volunteers but she she's not living in Jabodetabek area. So we create this 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 program to help uh, these women to become a volunteers uh, with the um, collaborate with the NGO or nonprofit institution in their cities in their area in, in, their, in their area. Okay. So um, actually, we want to give an assignment to to help this uh, nonprofit organization to grow in digital. Mm. So maybe the the institutional. Um, doesn't have a um, digital asset just like Twitter, Facebook or Instagram with these millennial girls, mini yeah. mini millennial women who really um, who really um, get used to it with the social media, they can help to set up and mm, maybe not only set up but they can help to promote mm -hmm. using hashtag mm -hmm. or just to promote to their um, their friends in, in, in campus mm -hmm. or in, in, the, in the workforce. Mm -hmm. So um, we want to make a collaboration between these women um, with the NGO who really have, um, you know, have a program but they don't have um, human capital to work with that. Yeah. So actually we want to make a cherry code for And this. how many volunteers and how many NGO are you currently working with? Um, actually this is the new one, uh, a new program and uh, now we're still selecting um, the the NGO and the volunteers, but we um, create maximum for 50, 50 volunteers and 50 NGO. Is there any reason why you you, you limit yourself into 50 50? Is it because it's more manageable and and you you be you able to focus in, yes. in, in a lot of um, ways? Actually, because this is the new one, so we want to review and we want to uh, monitoring and we want uh, to do. Uh, is this really? Is it really effective to do that or or not? So, so because this is only the the first batch, so I want to monitor. So you don't this. want to bite more than you can yeah. chew at the moment. So tell us about the mentors. You have six, five great mentors uh, you're working yes, with at the moment. Yes, they are very, very um, ins inspiring ladies. Um, yes, you have, have Nilam. Uh, you have yeah, Nilam Sari. From, Nilam Sari. Uh, she's a wonder of. Um, one of the biggest change of kebab. Of kebab. <laughs> All right. Uh, and we have Oli. She's um. She's a writer and. Uh, she's a writer and. and Actually, is a technology influencer for women in Indonesia. Correct. Correct. Um, we also have um, Imelda Francisca, she is mm -hmm. a, a former beauty pageant Miss Indonesia, mm -hmm. um, and so many people. Um, Imelda Francisca, and you have Hanifa Ambadar. Um, so, and, and, yes. and you have mentors of various uh, backgrounds to yeah. be able to uh, help develop and empower yep. uh, uh, your community. So tell us a little bit about how they, they, they came aboard and how. how uh, they're able to help you grow in a sense yes. of uh, of your organization. Um, actually, we're looking for the mentors who have you know who have a heart to help uh, these young women to to have their own success story. So, as a women, we tend to have um, you know role models so we can um, we look up to somebody. Yeah, we look right? up for somebody. You know, if if she can do that, say maybe I can do that yeah, too. Yeah. So we choose these mentors because we know they're, they are really active in community, um, they are really active in the social uh, activity too, so uh, we ask them, would you like to be a volunteer, uh, volunteer in your time uh, as a mentor? So they say, okay, I would, I would love to. So they join with this mentorship and they, they have, a, you know, they have the mentees and they can connect together just the sharing about their life their failures their success story to inspire these women so okay. yes so uh, for idea. instance in, in within that six month of facili uh, uh, facilitation work yeah. from Chewek Kuat to uh, the women do uh, will, are they able to speak to all of these mentors or it just depends on which mentors available at the time no no actually we we, al we already set the schedule mm -hmm. 
um, uh, bi monthly um, they have um, a chance to speak but they can also have um, you know create a group what group on whatsapp so they can chat personally to the mentors mm -hmm. so we connect and uh, we connect them to the mentors and we give them a chance to networking with them so you can use it uh, as a um, for your on benefit yeah, it's in a, a, a very way it's very fluid and organic yeah so there's there's not a lot of restrictions you just let them grow yeah now about the mentees in the six months uh, period are they following a certain uh, time schedule or this is also something that is uh, that that would get can be adjustable to their uh, no, their own yes. personal schedule. We actually have a schedule. Uh, we all already mentioned it uh, in the first time. You have uh, we have the six meeting. If you are absent for more than twice, then you have to drop out from oh. this program. Okay. So, so that's a commitment there. Yes, that's yeah. a commitment. Yeah. Um, and after and after that, we they have a assignment. The tasks just like created the tangbulan, um, the social project um, to to to. Uh, to give, to train um, the orphanage, uh, orphanage, orphan, orphan girls, orphanage, yeah. Yeah, orphanage girls um, yes. about entrepreneurial skills mm -hmm. and everything. They have to submit the the tasks and the, the assignments um, on time. So they don't if they don't submit the the tasks online, uh, no deadline on time. Um, they will get um, a fine. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so we want so to. So these are the small initiatives, incentives like, to make sure that these girls commit to, the, to yes, that six months. Yes, because plan. we want to. You know, um, we we have a lot of um, diligent women, clever women. But to be success, you have to have another factors that like discipline, on time, commitment, and responsibility. That's what um, the Cherik what wants to grow them. In so you're that, trying to yeah. uh, uh, develop that uh, uh, whole yeah, package for, that soft, for skills. You <laughs> soft skills. All right, we come back and we'll talk about these wonderful books that Bunga has brought to us in the studio after the short break. Mm -hmm.